Hello, and today I'll be showing you how to import tile sets, characters, auto tiles, uh, and music into RPG Maker XP. So first off, you need to open up your project, or a new one, and then when it's all loaded, just go to the materials icon. It should be this little folder on top. So when you open it, on the left, you should see all the categories for the files. On the right, you should see the actual files that are in the categories. So if we want to import a character, we just go to the characters category, click it, and we click import, and then go to where we saved our character picture. In my case, I put it on the desktop. So let's just go to the character, and then open it, and then you should come to this window. Now, as you see, I have this little frog character and a solid pink background. Uh, whenever you deal with tile sets, characters, and stuff like that, you always want to have a solid background. So on the background, you just would just right, left click, and then right click, and then you should see on the bottom, it changes color. That, that, that background will be then transparent in the game, so you only would see your character. So then, just click OK, and then you'll see your character with a little orange icon. The little orange icon just signifies that it is a custom character you imported it. So you can just preview it and you'll see there's no pink anymore, it's just white and that just means it's transparent. Same thing goes with tile sets, so let's just add tile set, import, go to where you saved it, open it, and same thing with the background, just left click, right click, OK. Uh, auto tiles, same thing. Left click, right click, OK. Um, now with music, you just go down here and it's like background music, background sound, sound effects, and I'm pretty sure it's just like music effects. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I'm just gonna import some background music. So you just go there, import to where you saved it and then just select it. I'm pretty sure uh, WAV files, WAV, work, or pretty sure any any uh, five of these would work. So then just open it, and you can see you imported it. And really, the same goes with like window skins, and titles, and pictures, and everything else. It's, just, it's really just click it, import it, and open it. So uh, rate, comment, subscribe and I hope you enjoyed.